and a very warm welcome to my guests in studio with me this morning. How are you, gentlemen? Good, good morning. Friends, today we're actually talking our Queen of Soca. I'm sure it's going to ring a bell. Our Queen of Soca, no Soca, no life, as I welcome our Mr. Geddes King, who's the casting director and talent developer, and Mr. Kevin Adams, filmmaker, director, and creator of the movie, and of course, Mr. Navindra Harbukan, who is audiovisual editor with his fancy equipment there. Hi. <laughs> All right, Kevin, so I'm going to start with you, um, filmmaker, director, creator of the movie. Let's take it back. Uh, to when uh, the concept was born. How long ago and how long have you all been working on this particular project? The concept was, good morning listeners, um, the concept was born in uh, 2012. Mm -hmm. uh, we wrote a 30-minute film for the Chanan Tobago Film Company mm -hmm. and they liked it. Uh, they gave us a grant to go out and shoot the film. Um, at that time, we were calling it Queen of Soka because our vision of for the film was actually to be a 90-minute film. Okay. Um, but their vision was, you know, we're giving you a check to do 30 minutes. So <laughs> right. we had to do 30 minutes. So we, we, you know, we had some back and forth in terms of changing the name because mm -hmm. we always wanted to do the 90 minute film. Mm -hmm. um, so in the interim, we did the 30 minute film. We put it out in the Trinidad Tobago Film Festival where we won a couple of awards and... Yeah, it's been playing out there. Flow video on demand a couple of places. And of course, some uh, big names attached to the uh, film as well. Tell us about uh, some of the actors and actresses in this one. Yes, absolutely. Um, well, this film, it starred Terry Lyons. She was our main star. Mm -hmm. um, and I don't think a lot of people expected to see Terry Lyons as the, as the star, see her as an actress. You know, they're so accustomed with her um, involved in music. Yes, but Terry Lyons, for her first time, you know, auditioning for us, it was it was crazy. I mean, I wasn't expecting what I saw. Off mm -hmm. the back, I knew we were going to choose her, but we couldn't let her know that in there. Right. You know, we had to work it all out. Mm -hmm. But yeah, and we also had Penelope Spencer, who is amazing. I mean, she's, I mean, you could see her in theater like every weekend mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. everyone hires her to do everything. Mm -hmm. Michael Cherry, Denise Belfon. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was crazy. It was just crazy working with all these great talents, you know, and the thing is, we see all these, most of these people in music, right. but we never see them trying to do something else. Mm -hmm. And I think that's part of what we want to do. We want to see people who never thought about doing something. Maybe their family member think that, hey, you're funny or a cousin or, mm -hmm. or someone. And basically what, you know, what we want to do is get everyone out to the casting call that we're having coming up. Yeah. And help them discover some of the, some of these talents. Now, I know you mentioned awards. Can you tell us just uh, uh, maybe a few of the awards of the movie uh, won? The first award it, it won was the grant from the Trinidad and Tobago Film Company. Mm -hmm. The second award it won was Terry Lyons winning Best Actress. I remember that. Mm -hmm. um, well, special selection, of course, at the film festival. And then we won the BPTT uh, Script and Development Award. How was that for you? I mean, on winning all these awards, what was that experience like? You know, when you heard one, you were nominated and then two to actually win and take, take away these awards. I mean, I'm a humble kind of guy, you know. <laughs> so, so you know, when you win, it's just like, yes, finally. But it's encouraging, but, you but, know. No, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. I think that that encouraged me to actually go back and work on the script even more because mm -hmm. even though we had written the 90 minute version of the film, it wasn't where I feel it could be. And we went back and do some work on it, and it's. I'm telling you, it's so much better now. Great. And that's the stage that we are at, are working now on the 90-minute production. Is that right? Yeah. All right. So there's a casting call uh, to be part of it, and it's going to go under the title um, Queen of Soka. Queen of Soka. Right, with the 90 minutes. So this is the full production, the one that you guys actually dreamed and envisioned. Yeah. All right. That's so tell us about the casting call. All right. So basically, we are looking for talented people. We're looking for, actually, we... There are some people who are very talented and don't even know it. Mm -hmm. Like um, I was saying early on that Denise Belfon, all these years singing, I mean, mm -hmm. being a great performer on mm -hmm. stage. Mm -hmm. And then to see Denise on camera is totally amazing. But to get on stage, that's a little bit of theater in itself. Eh? Yeah, it, it, it's you know. It's a little bit and of bringing it and acting. And very quickly, can we just touch on maybe some of the characters or some of the roles that we're looking to fill? Certainly. Um, one of the well, there's quite a few roles. Mm -hmm. um, we have um, the nemesis uh, in terms of the protagonist, the mm -hmm. antagonist of the film, mm -hmm. which is someone who's going to sing against our, our main star in the film. Right? Okay. So her role is just this this sexy, beautiful, tall, vibesy kind of female mm -hmm. that can, 
you know, once you see her, you know she's an automatic star. Right. So that's one of the characters we're looking for. Um, most of the characters that we're looking for is between the ages of 18 and 30. Okay, yeah, that's it. That's what I want to get at, the demographics. Yeah. So between 18 and 30? Yeah, between 18 and 30. Mm -hmm. um, however, we do have other characters in terms of, like, there's a preacher in the film. Right. Um, that demographic is between 30 and 50. Mm -hmm. um, and that's like a, a slick-talking kind of pastor, you know, real... Again, the, fil the entire film is vibes. Okay. So people who really know how to bring out something different from inside that you could show it on film. And that's what we were looking for. Um, we also have uh, another interesting character. Um, her name is Candy, and she's a kind of thick, curvaceous girl who can talk her way through anything. And, you know, all the fellas, you know, she always... Um, you know, winking an eye at guys, right, and, you right. know, that kind of yeah, vibe. Yeah, little so, flirtation, yeah, yeah, kind yeah. of get her way kind of thing. Yes, <laughs> yes. So, I mean, besides that, we have uh, roles for approximately 10 to 12 main characters in the film. All right. When so, And, and mm -hmm. over 25 roles. When and where is the casting? The casting is going to take place at um, on Dundano Street, which is Necessary Arts. Mm -hmm. um, that's 44 um, Dundano Street to the exact. Mm -hmm. May 9th. May 9th, and the time is basically what we do. Which is, is next week, Saturday. Yes. Next right. week, Saturday, that's correct. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to have scheduled um, actors come in from the from 12.30 p.m. until 2 p.m., mm -hmm. and then from 2 p.m. onwards until 8 p.m., it's going to be an open call. It's for open for oh, excellent. anyone. You're sitting at your desk right now, you're thinking, hey, I want to do something extra in my life. I want to mm -hmm. have some extra fun. Mm -hmm. I'm getting bored of swimming. I'm getting bored of, of football. Mm -hmm. Nose, calm down. Or maybe you're just stuck in a rut and you're not sure and you want yeah. something. You know, you want to maybe discover some some um, talent that, that you didn't know you yes. had. Or you might be passionate about it, but you were a little bit too scared. Or you didn't know where you could find the opportunity. Yeah, this is the opportunity right now knocking on your door here on Slam. And we'll actually work with you. We will work with you. And Slam is a station works with, with youths as well. You know, they, they support people. They, they mm -hmm. support the local talent um, just come out remind us where we can get more information because I know that you have the, the, the characters that you're searching for published um, Facebook Twitter phone number tell us how, how can we touch base with you get more information yes we have a Facebook event page called Queen of Soka Casting 2 mm -hmm. um, 2 as in Roman numerals uh, 2 um, we also have a f um, fan page uh, Queen of Soka D Movie mm -hmm. on Facebook and we have a face. I'm sorry we also have a website queenofsokamovie.com our yeah. email address is queenofsokamovie at gmail.com so once you email us we send you right back all the information you need about the casting mm -hmm. um, we do have sites for the casting or you could come with something sure that you can see on your own for the casting as well but we, we provide you with all that information so when you come you're actually prepared so once again just give them that phone number it's they can call 316-0282 316-316-0282. All right, excellent. So we're taking the casting. Remember, it happens next week, Saturday. Uh, we're going from 1, 1 p.m. or 2 p.m.? 12.30 p.m. 12.30? p.m. All the way to 8 p.m. All the way till 8 p.m. Yeah, so it's going to be a long time frame Saturday. There. Yeah, but we're that's a good window, fun. you know? Yeah. Walk come with on. lunch, everyone. Walk with lunch. <laughs> excellent window to come on and be part of it. Of course, you want to get involved. And like they say, they're going to be grooming your talent. So uh, maybe you needed to hear this this morning. Um, so after the casting, when do we look out for, maybe not the release of the movie, but, but final production? Do you all have a wrap date, that kind of thing already? We have a wrap date in mind, but... As this production go, it, it always changes. But we're actually hoping that we can have it out in cinemas um, by December. December 2015? Yes, that's All correct. Right. December 2015, yes. All right. Well, gentlemen, thank you very much for coming in and sharing that information. Um, any Anything you want to get in? Anything that we perhaps didn't let the public know that you want to share? What we're doing is a professional production. I think that's one of the things that we didn't let out there. I know these days everyone get caught up in the little, you know, pull out your camera and point and yeah, shoot. Go, bro. Yeah, yeah. And <laughs> yeah. just, you know, and, and n not knocking anyone who have their little camera and trying mm -hmm. stuff, but, you know, we're beyond trying. We reach a point where, you know, we understand the business okay. and we're really pushing for great quality, great content, great acting, you know, so it's not a friend, friend thing where, you know, someone coming like, hey, I'm a partner. She work on a radio. I'm a guess she to play this role. No, you know, we take all the roles seriously. We take Very. the entire production seriously. So, when anyone come to cast, we want them to have that same attitude. Not that, not saying that don't have fun, but come out, you know, ready to be professional. 
Excellent. Ready to be professional, friends? This is your call. You heard it right here on Slam on the preset. Uh, be sure to check it out on Facebook. Uh, Queen of Soka, the movie, they've got that Facebook page. We gave you the numbers. So you know what you need to do. Uh, the movie casting also has a page. So it's Queen of Soka, the movie casting. And you can see all the characters and uh, all the roles there to see if you, you may fit a role or if you know someone who will fit the role. Or you can just give them a call and just get more information, you know? A fantastic opportunity for you. So, friends, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having us, Sorella. No problem. It's my absolute pleasure to uh, be sharing with you. You I've been following this one for a while, so I'm excited to see what plays off.